now. Where are we going? We are going to Singapore first, and then we're going to go to Japan. Japan! We are off! We've checked in, we've got all our bags on the plane, and now we're just waiting to board the plane. So we're going on Singapore Airlines. It's not your typical it's just, it's gonna be trip. It's going to be a very, I think it's going to be very spiritual for us, really. That's what I was going to use before. Just interrupted me. Sorry. Wish us luck. First leg of the journey. By the way, just as a side note, we actually, for everyone who's probably going, oh my god, you guys must have like, studied the language. Yeah, we did it. Oh, yeah, I heard this is really. I don't know, lots of people have said that it's like a really bad language barrier and then the other people have said like, it's not. Probably because know. they knew the language. <laughs> <laughs> See how this goes. So we've made it to Singapore, it's currently 3, 3 a.m. Brisbane time, so it's like, I think it's only 12 or 1 in Singapore. Um, very tired, I can't sleep on planes. Ugh, layovers, this is my first one I've experienced. And I think we've only been here for an hour, and we're here for 9 hours. So we've given up on the sleeping, 40 minutes, and we're goners. And we decided we'll go out and find something to do in the airport. And now we're sitting back down. <laughs> Demo, what just happened? I bought a curry potato vegetable puff, and I went to buy into my third one, and it was... I'm going to be sick. I feel like this is going to be literally the butt of everything to What's this? Hot fresh grass? Oh, don't I do. You tell me, what have your thoughts been of Singapore so far? I'm just hungry. <laughs> and tired. But I love it. Look, it's a freaking piece of lettuce. Oh, hold on. You know what? You know what? I got this. Hard to exercise whilst travelling. Doing it. I'm too tired. I'm this close to literally sipping on someone's face. I'm hungry. I've only had an hour sleep. Like, I'm, I'm done. So, you never guess what just happened. Just my luck. We just got to the terminal about five minutes to boarding and we got told there's a ty typhoon. A typhoon in Japan. So, the flight's now not till 12 and we haven't slept and. So I just find it really funny, um, it's just like this, oh there's a typhoon in Japan so we're not going to send you this one more day, it's like, there's a typhoon in Japan and you want to send me that? Like, <laughs> hey, Let's go to Canada or something. We're going to get there eventually, don't know what time, I just don't want to be going when there's a typhoon because I get anxious, a anxious, is that anxious enough? So, crush your fingers, this just means more time for Starbucks. Because you know, everyone else would totally not get anxious at the thought of a typhoon. Captain speaking. Okay. My name is Kenneth Cox. Flight two, we're on. The last two on the plane. God. Guess who made it to Japan? Finally made it. So good. Oh my gosh. How bumpy was that? That was so bumpy. It was really Actually funny. scary. Like when we landed the plane. Yes. <gasps> but it was really funny because like I turned to Lucy and I was just I just thought in my head like oh man I'm so glad that you're here with me. Yeah. Have anyone better to exactly. be with? Exactly. Mm -hmm. oh. No anxiety. <laughs> oh, right back at you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Talk about minimalistic. Wow. That's the entirety of this room. This is literally 
what we're given we have to make the bed up ourselves um got like this is going to be quite an experience i think hope you guys enjoy that little airport journey and look forward to more adventures to come good night